Have you ever wondered how the Romans, without modern technology, managed to supply water to their ever-expanding empire? It all began with the conception of the Aqua Appia in 312 BC. Imagine the sheer ingenuity needed to craft such an impressive system in that period. The Romans harnessed their engineering prowess, constructing an infrastructure that would quench the thirst of their burgeoning empire. So, the Aqua Appia laid the foundation for the Roman Empire's extensive water system. With the success of the Aqua Appia, the Roman Empire expanded its water system. The burgeoning empire witnessed the construction of ten more aqueducts over the next five centuries. This was no small feat. Each aqueduct was a marvel of engineering, an intricate system of channels, tunnels and bridges designed to transport water from distant sources to the heart of the empire. Imagine the scale of these projects. The Aqua Martia, for instance, stretched out over an astonishing 92 kilometers, making it one of the longest aqueducts of its time. And then there was the Aqua Claudia, a grand structure that stood tall even under the weight of the Empire's expectations. Each aqueduct was more than just a conduit for water. It was a testament to the Empire's ambition and its unyielding desire for progress. The Roman Empire's thirst for growth and advancement led to the creation of an elaborate water system. The Romans were not just builders, but innovators as well. The Romans' ingenious use of gravity and siphoning techniques revolutionized water transport. They harnessed the power of gravity to move water over vast expanses, even uphill, by creating a steady, gentle gradient. They also utilized siphoning techniques to overcome geographical obstacles. But their crowning achievement was the invention of waterproof concrete. This ingenious material allowed them to construct durable aqueducts that stood the test of time. Innovation was key to the success of the Roman water system. The Romans did not stop at bringing water to the city. They ensured it reached every corner. The distribution system was a marvel of engineering, utilizing lead pipes to transport water from the aqueducts to public fountains, baths, and even private households. This intricate network ensured a steady flow of water across the empire. In fact, the Roman Empire's water system was as much about distribution as it was about supply. Maintaining such a vast system required a structured approach. The Romans, ever the engineers, created the role of water commissioner. This official, known as a curator aquarum, was tasked with overseeing the aqueducts, ensuring their proper function and upkeep. Alongside this, the empire established a complex set of laws governing water usage, ensuring fair distribution and preventing misuse. This legal framework was as intricate as the waterways themselves. The Roman Empire recognized the importance of maintaining and governing its water system effectively. But what happens when an empire falls? Picture Rome, once the world's mightiest empire, now in decline. As the empire's power waned, so did the upkeep of its exceptional water system. Without the necessary resources and manpower, aqueducts fell into disrepair, often succumbing to neglect and vandalism. Rome's once vibrant fountains and bathhouses dried up, mirroring the city's dwindling fortunes. The Romans' mastery over water, which had once symbolized their dominance, was lost. With the fall of the Roman Empire, their intricate water system also crumbled. Yet, the legacy of the Roman water system lives on. The principles and techniques employed by the Romans are not relics of the past, but cornerstones of modern water systems. The gravity-based flow water purification methods and the use of aqueducts can be seen mirrored in today's infrastructure. Their meticulous planning and governance set a standard for public utilities that we still aspire to. Indeed, the Roman Empire's water system is not just history, it's a blueprint. The Roman Empire's water system continues to inspire modern engineering. So, from its birth to its legacy, the Roman Empire's water system was a marvel of its time. This intricate system, from its inception during the expansion era to the innovative techniques, showcased Rome's engineering prowess. Their meticulous distribution and maintenance methods, even in the face of the Empire's fall, laid the groundwork for modern water systems. If you enjoyed this journey through the Roman Empire's water system, please share, like and subscribe to our channel for more captivating historical tales.